So you know the drill. We're going to roll a challenge before the perks. I think I'm going to have the second game without the challenge. Because three challenges makes it so that I don't, I can't really think of new challenges that fast. And then when three challenges get taken away for a week, I can't really make up three new challenges that fast. So I need to do two challenges so I can take out two challenges and then have two challenges rotate in and out of new ones every single week. If you, if you understand what I'm trying to say. Yeah. <laughs> hey, the sound disappeared. Oh, the sound just blew off my eardrums too. The sound disappeared again. I'm probably gonna have to edit in sound if it keeps disappearing like that. But yeah, we got no use in spacebar. Probably the fucking worst one to get. I gotta make sure that I play at least another 150 shards worth today so I can so I can get sprint burst out of the stupid shrine and put it in the fucking wheel. Cause I don't have it here. I need to get more perks, just more. I don't care what it is, I just need to get more. Right now it seems pretty good. It's fine, chill. Not that bad. The sound's not disappearing this time. What the fuck? I don't want both of them. I'm never gonna not know where the killer is. And plunders. Oh my god, here we go. Since I got plunders, give me uh, something else that's gonna increase my luck. I got the most random perks. Like plunders and resilience, and premonition and spine chill. What the hell is that shit? So no using spacebar. Oh god. I don't think I'm gonna forget that I'm not supposed to use spacebar, but because it's not like looking back where it's a natural reaction. I just can't use my spacebar. Which means no pulling down pallets, no jumping over windows, no doing anything, and I gotta fucking hide. And he's over that way. And the only thing I can use spacebar on is the generator. Because if I can't hit the fucking skill checks, then I basically can't do anything. This means I have to hide. I can't be getting caught and shit. I can be getting, like, seen, but I gotta hide. Like, I gotta lose them fast. Which is not gonna be easy with the hillbilly. But I can do it! He can't do it. <laughs> Tapping on the hook. Okay, I can use spacebar on the hook. Because I can't just kill myself on the fucking hook. That means I'm out of a health state. And that's not going to be fun. Oh my god. Where the heck is the guy at? Okay, he's getting him. And I'm going to run over to this guy. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh shit, I use spacebar, fuck. Ah! <laughs> ah! He killed himself! <laughs> I can't use spacebar and I went inside the fucking locker like an idiot. Oh, uh, don't fucking leave. Okay. I thought it was gonna be one of those guys. I almost made it and you couldn't just body block them a little bit? Here we go. And this guy's basically not gonna run over here. What are you doing, fam? 
What are you doing? This is a bad idea, guys. <laughs> oh, fuck. I can't use the space bar! This is so bad! I can't use the space bar! I can't use the space bar. I can't use the space bar! Can't use the space bar! I can't use a space bar! I don't even know why I'm trying to juke him like that because I can't use the fucking space bar. <laughs> don't try to heal me! Just run away! Maybe if they separated the buttons a little bit, like jumping over windows different button than getting into a locker and shit like that which it should be because lockers are sitting right beside windows and pallets and shit so you get sucked into them but yeah crawl over to me we could die together what you doing fam can you just kill me like this is fucking boring as shit thank you oh my god he's fucking I think I'm gonna split the no using spacebar up to no using pallets and no using windows. As, so it's two different ones. And so I'm not so shit out of luck and just running around places. And then I'm not even gonna put no using lockers because like lockers are basically not even that much of a use most of the time. So this game we're not gonna do any challenge. And then for the last game we'll do a challenge. So it puts in like a, like an old perk wheel and the new perk wheel together. And I want to figure out something else to do so that I can do the challenge to the first one, then nothing the second one, and then something else the third one. I don't know yet. I got to think of something. Got to think of something nice. Something where if someone copies it, then you basically you know who's copying it. Thank God I got one making. Better than no item though. Fucking small game. I swear to God, if I get slippery meat, I swear. Yeah, you better go past that slippery meat, boy. Ace in the hole. Now give me plunders. I'll, I'll, I'll appreciate plunders now that I got ace in the hole. Or give me up the ante. Because then I'll still go in boxes and shit. Give me my up the ante. I need to dunk on some people.
great. I gotta start switching these fucking perks around. I always get the same ones. I don't know. It's probably because it loves those perks. I've switched it around before and it's still giving me the same ones. <laughs> Alright. I kind of don't remember the perks, but I'll remember them. Don't worry. It's not going to happen like last time. But it, these are the perks. Edit in and after. Because I don't remember them. What I honestly think they should do is they should put it so that the generators, like there's different models for the generators. So it's not just these things poking out of the fucking earth. See these things all the way across the map. There should be like generators, like little tiny generators and then big generators on like the wall maybe or like on random trees. Like the generators should have different models. And not all of them have this thing at the top. I think it would make it a lot better. Where you actually have to search for the generator instead of it just being there already and you know exactly where to go. Because if you had to search for the generator, it would make it a lot harder. But right now, all you got to do is look across the map and you're like, oh shit, there's the lights flashing in the distance. That means there's a generator. Maybe like have smaller generators basically go faster than the bigger generators, but maybe have like you have to have two smaller generators, a medium sized generator, and or two medium sized generators and a big generator. And then the big generators take longer than the medium size, and the medium size take longer than the smaller generators. Smaller generators can only have one person on it, medium size can only have two, and then the big ones can have up to four if there's if they spawn in the right spot. I'm just thinking of different ways where it would be fun as a survivor. Because right now it's not that exciting. Stop chasing me! Go away! What do you want? Go after someone else. Yeah, bitch. Go that way. You better get over there. Don't come back. Go over there. Over there. Over there. Over there. Over, over there. Yeah. Better listen to me. Ho. Fuck around with the Monto. Shove my toe in your butt. The um, nurses. Like, new nurses don't feel comfortable doing short blinks. I don't know why. They're one of the easiest blinks to hit. Your auto-aim does everything for you. Ah! <laughs> they both ran for it the exact same time. I'm gonna stay hurt, get these generators, and then I'll heal myself. No, I don't want to be healed. Oh shit, hello, how's it going? I thought she was gonna- try. Oh my god! <laughs> I wanted the power. Bill? I know you got borrowed time. I know you do. I know you do. I know you got borrowed time, Bill. I know you do. You're playing Bill. Of course you got borrowed time. Billy Bob!
I'm stuck. Billy Bobby's coming. I kind of wanted to stay hurt, Billy Bob. All of us are here. Everybody's just running, look up. I can't see where I'm going. I kind of can. I gotta find my way over to this generator by sound. Oh yeah. I'm doing a challenge without even getting the challenge. Except I'm looking up all the time. Alright, following the wall to get to this door. The door should be right over here. Somewhere. Just keep following the wall and you'll find it. Fuck, fuck looking up. God damn it, you stole my door! Now I gotta go find a totem. Billy Bob, you're bringing him over here and I'm trying to get this totem. Run! Billy Bob, no! <laughs> Dip! Just keep running! You can't catch me, I'm the gingerbread man! Oh fuck. <laughs> well, that was a fun game. I was doing a challenge without even getting the challenge. I was just running around with my head up. If he was playing anyone else other than a nurse, it probably would have ended really bad. I still got only look up in a chase because I started doing it after I realized that he was a little bit more new of a nurse. I'm trying to look for a good game with it. But using 2, 4, 5, 6 on my Naga is going to be a pain in the ass instead of WASD. I already know that for a fact. It's probably gonna work better than not being able to use a space bar, but oh, and I get it in there. Great. Why does the sound keep cutting out? Hmm. If four and six is left and right, two and five is forward and back. Hmm. I was just thinking if I could use one hand for left and right, and then use my thumb for back and forward. And I don't think that's gonna work. I think just using my thumb for all of them is gonna work better. And just using my finger for... Oh God, this is gonna end very bad, isn't it? Urban Invasion and Dark Sense. Okay. What would go good? I kind of need to be stealthy in this one. So a lightweight would be good. And maybe even a spine chill just so I can tell where he is. And I get no one left behind. Urban Invasion, Dark Sense, no one left behind, and another piece of fucking garbage. Watch me get no perk. Good. Iron Will. At least it's something good. Urban Evasion. Dark Sense. No one left behind. And Iron Will. Alright. So we're going to change the controls. This is two. This is four. This is five, 
and this is six. Holy shit, this is gonna be a pain in the ass. <laughs> oh, fuck. Here we go. Wait, let me see who I'm facing before I go into this. Zimbabwe? Candabish. I know you. I know you. And your fucking goddamn weird ass fucking I love you Barney song. I swear I'm getting possessed when I listen to <laughs> when I listen to your shit, fam. I swear I'm getting possessed. Two, four, five, six. Playing against Candabish. The motherfucking guy with the weird ass music and shit. God, God damn it. Oh yeah, I gotta use two, four, five, six. Right now I can't, like, I can't. What the fuck is going on, fam? What the hell happened? What the hell happened? What the actual fuck happened? Stand. Everybody left. <laughs> ah. This game is fucked. <laughs> oh. This game is completely fucked. <laughs> Maybe everyone won't goddamn leave the game this time and I'll be able to play. With my 246 or 2456. It's actually just a little bit hard because one is the point. I kind of took up the uh, the come over here, the waving part with the two, but Whatever. It's actually not too hard to use it like this. I just can't turn my my camera that well because I I have to hold two to do it, and it's hard to switch it up with my thumb while trying to turn behind me. And we're facing a fucking hillbilly. This is gonna be fun. Uh, fuck you, three o'clock. I hate you so much with my all my life. I hate you with a passion. I think I'm gonna use two on my key. How did I wave? Whoa! Holding shift and clicking two is letting me wave. Oh, it's because two wave is both of them now. Wave is moving and two. You can put two buttons on one. They don't override each other. Oh shit. The buttons don't override each other. So if I, I just click two and it'll wave. I, okay, that gives me a lot more ideas actually for challenges. Hmm. Interesting. Like for only running, for once the only run, I can put shift and W 
No, because huh, I wonder how that would work. Shift and W, and then I use ASD in order to move the other ways. But I'm holding Shift at the same time as holding W. So I wonder what would go down if that happened. So many possibilities now. What? Oh my god. Look at this spot. This spot's amazing. It's so hard because in order to do a spin, I have to go like do some weird ass shit. And I keep pressing the fucking one button that's beside the two button on my Naga. So I keep stopping to try and fucking point. No, come back. I heal you. Very good. I keep trying to press W and I don't move. <laughs> uh, fuck. That box is an amazing hiding spot. And I didn't know you can go behind it. That's so dope. And I bet you it's gonna be gone by the next couple of patches. If I keep using it. Ah! It didn't even go after me. I keep pressing a different button. Fuck you. I'm, if I'm doing this challenge ever again, I gotta take it. That the point off of one. Oh shit. I'm trying to press two. Oh, nice. Oh, why are you going after the same guy again? Come on. Come on. Stop being a little bitch and going after the same fucking guy because you want to fucking kill. Goddamn fucking people and shit. I want to see if this hiding spot works. Shit, I can't get into it. I can't get into it like I did before. Oh fuck, fuck this shit, fuck this shit, fuck this shit. Wait. This guy's probably waiting by the fucking hatch. I'm just gonna leave. This Zoof guy left a long time ago. That's a good spot if it lets me go in as far as I got in before the first time. It's a fucking sick spot. And next time I do two, four, five, six, I'm taking off the goddamn one because I keep pointing in the middle of me running. How did I get 18,000 points? Just all about this money. I don't think about no thighs. No thigh. Girl, you don't know about me. me. So get off my fucking D. My Born D. and raised in the thigh. Die. This is real as you gon' see. You see. Girl, you don't know about me. So me. get off my